everybody, welcome back to our channel. I am Namisha and today I'm going to draw a bunny in a flower field. So let's get started. So first we are going to sketch out the basic shapes of the bunny. We are going to do kind of an oval for the face of the bunny. So we are using watercolor pencils to sketch so that once you paint the pencil marks will not show on it. So it's just an oval for the face of the bunny. And then we are going to do a neck. We have to start over here and then come down. draw a basic shape so this is how it looks right now it's just the outline of the shapes that we drew so next we are going to do a tail for it a little round yeah, we don't have to work on the details because we are going to color it after and then we are going to draw the feet at the back just to make a shape. And then also we will draw the front feet. And one leg that is one feet that's behind so after doing the basic shapes on a rough sketch this is how it looks uh, right now it doesn't look like a bunny but it just has the shape so next we will go and uh, draw a mouth and a little nose and then we will draw an eye for it. It looks uh, tear shaped. To sketch an outline and then draw the eyeballs inside. Yeah. And the next thing is the bunny ears. So you can make the ear stand out or you can make it floppy just the way you like it yeah, and yeah now we all we have a little outline if you want you can add some details to the ears and stuff add some fur to it but we are going to use oil pastels to color it So this is how it is looking currently and uh, I think we are ready to use some pastel colors on it. So we have, uh, uh, this is a peach color and the other one is a brown that we are going to use. So first we are going to use the peach color to color it inside. And uh, after that we will add some brown fur to it. So we are starting with the ears. And then when we do the face, even instead of coloring it in just anyways, we are going to try to add some 
texture to it so that it looks like fur. We will do it in small strokes and we'll go along the face of the bunny. So before we move along, we are just going to uh, use a sharpie to mark the eyes and the nose. So now we are going to move along. So while painting the body also, we are trying to give add some strokes to it so that it looks more like the like fur so this is how it looks now and uh, next we are going to start with the brown. We will start on the ears and give it an outline so that it has like two colors. And while coloring with the brown also make sure that you add some strokes to it so that it looks it has a little bit of a fur texture to it. Now we will do the face and so there are some white spaces if we see and uh, we are trying to while using the brown we will try to fill those parts up but still we will make strokes on it like fur. Yeah, and then we'll do the body as well, the same way. So this is how it looks now. And now we are going to use a little bit of gray to add some more fur to it. So this is how our bunny looks. So we look, we are, we are pretty happy with it because we tried something with oil pastels and texture for the first time. And for the background, we are just going to uh, use green pastels to fill the background. And then uh, we will paint some grass and flowers with acrylic. So first step, just fill in the background with uh, light green pastel colors. So I'm just gonna fill it out. You can uh, apply some more pressure to make it darker or if you want to keep it light that's also fine. So after coloring the green this is how it looks right now and uh, I'm going to quickly spread some fixative to it before starting with the acrylic color. If you want, I am going to put the link to the fixative uh, in the description of the video. And uh, yeah, I really like this because after putting this also, it's easy to again use the oil pastels again. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Next, we are going to start with the acrylic paints. 
so first we are going to use the toothbrush and uh, we are using light green to do some grass around the paws of the bunny so when we do the brush we start from the bottom and then we make this pose up top yeah make some around here and here as well so you can make grasses all around here and there here So also some behind on the top. So in the next step, we also got some deep green so that the grasses have multiple colors, like two shades of green. That's good. So next we have some uh, yellow and red paint and we are going to paint some daisies. So first just we are going to mark the positions so that we know where we want our daisies to be. So we are doing some red dots now. So it looks pretty good now also but we decided to make it daisy so we are going to use white paint to paint the yellow flowers so just make some petals around it small petals and So we did some uh, white, now we are also doing some yellow flowers with the red in the center. So yeah, I think uh, that's all we are going to do for these. And uh, as it looks good, I think, at this point. And the next step is just to take this off so that it has a nice, pretty outline to it. So this is how my painting turned out. I hope you all liked this video. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.